Hi, welcome back to another video. My name is Marissa and today we are going to draw a shark in some water and it's going to be a surprise fold. So first step you need to do is fold the top of your paper to the bottom like this. Next you take off the first part and you bring it to the top of your paper. Make a crease. Now turn it over. You're going to take the bottom and go up to the top. And then you're going to make a crease. Now you should open it like this. And then you're going to bring the top half down so that it ends up looking like this. And then we can fold up and down. I'm going to put a paper behind this paper so that it doesn't bleed through the back of it. Sometimes my pens do that. Next you get your pen and we're going to start making some water on the outside. You're going to make waves just kind of random wherever you want. My waves are going to look like this, just curves going out. I'm going to close it up by making a line down from the top to the bottom. And you can close it if you want to. I'm deciding to close it. This is the part where you get to draw. You can maybe make a fish. I'm going to make some bubbles. Just kind of wherever you want to. My bubbles are going to come down here. Now we're going to make the shark. If you open it up, it's kind of going to look like a big giant shark face in the middle. So what you do is you start from this edge and go up, make it pointed at the top and come down to the bottom like this. We're going to make the shark's teeth in the middle. First, we need to make a curve for the mouth going down. And then we're going to make a line going across that's curved. We're going to make two endpoints here for that curve. We're going to make some teeth. All the teeth are is just a bunch of random triangles. You can make them bigger as you come to the middle and then they go smaller as, as we go out. Same thing for the bottom, little triangles all the way to the edge. And we're going to make two circles for the nose. We'll make some gills by drawing three curves and another three curves on this side to match. We're going to draw his stomach by making a curve across. We'll make his fins by drawing two kind of lines like that and another over here. There we go. Now it's up to you, but I want to make the bubbles continue down. And this part is kind of going to look like he's jumping out of the frame because I took the arm or the fin and I didn't go through it, but I went around. I'm going to close it off on this edge all the way down. The bubbles I want to continue so it looks like it's part of the original drawing. Like this. You can also make um, maybe seaweed or something that comes up. It's up to you. Now I'm going to draw 
the eyes. The eyes are going to start about here and color it in. And then another one on the other side. Oops, I drew a bubble there, but that's okay. I'm going to draw it over the bubble and color it in. That worked out. He has to see. There we go. Just trying to make it even. Okay, let's color it in. So there we go. We have our surprise fold. When you open it up, it's a shark. And when you close it up, nothing suspicious in the water. You can always draw a fish up at the top and then maybe it'll look like he's going to eat it. It's up to you. I had fun with this one. Please subscribe to the channel and I will see you next time. Bye guys.